Hey, it's Maria Levine here today with you. I'm going to share a fun little technique to create an embellishment, a fabric embellishment, which you can use on cards, scrap of pages, or tags, um, using some canvas. This is uh, two little canvas pieces that I already have pre-cut ready to go. Uh, the canvas that I use is actually a, dr a big drop cloth that you can get at a home improvement store, such as Home Depot or Lowe's. And when you do look for these in those stores, just be sure you get the kind that does not have um, the plastic coating on the back. You just want the solid, all, all fabric. Um, so I already have these pre-cut ready to go. And today we're going to use, we're going to create a heart. It is Valentine's Day today while I'm recording this. So I went with the heart Valentine's theme. And we're going to use this heart from the Ippity Kit called Straight from the Heart to create our little embellishment. So what I'm going to do very simply is I'm going to stamp... I'm going to do it in black ink just so you'll be able to see it better on the video. But of course you can use any color. I'm using an archival waterproof type ink which stamps pretty well on the canvas. I know stays on will work well as well. So let's just stamp the heart right in the center. So there's our heart stamped on our canvas. So I'm going to take both the pieces because basically now I'm going to, I'm going to want to cut this out. But first we want to, we want to attach this together. We're going to create a little um, dimensional pillow effect with this. And so you, you might have seen this before at Fabric and people bring out the sewing machine and start sewing. I'm not a fan of sewing. I have a sewing machine, hardly ever use it. I keep, it keeps jamming on me. <laughs> and I've done this type of thing before and I hand stitched. But then I'm thinking about the whole Tim Holtz grungy style and I'm like, you know, let's do something different today. So I'm going to pull out my tiny attacher or a stapler. And these, this tiny attacher is fabulous because it's tiny little staples rather than the larger staples that a standard stapler has. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to staple these pieces together around this heart, kind of, you know, along the little dotted line, kind of, a few staples that will hold it together. And I'm going to leave an opening up top. Go straight around with this. This um, stapler goes through anything. It's absolutely fabulous. So now I have a bunch of little staples, which you can see. Hopefully you can see it in the video, I'm not sure. Um, and if you can't, that's even better because then it kind of blends in. And if you don't like the look of it, you may, you're not going to see it that well. Or if you like that grunge look, it's, it's great. So I'm going to go around and I'm going to cut out the heart now. I'll leave a little extra around the edges. Another tip for you when you're using fabric, try to have a... Um, a scissor dedicated just for fabric and ribbon. I'm sure a lot of you do. I didn't for a long time and finally I just, I mean it's a very inexpensive pair of scissors I just have lying around uh, that I just decided, okay, you know what? That's going to just be ribbon, fabric, anything fabric. And it, it does make a huge difference. So now I cut out my heart. It's all stapled together. It's two layers. have a little pocket. So we're going to stuff it to create a little pillow. And I'm going to just use a basic old cotton ball. Simple. I'm going to just pull it apart a little bit. You don't even need a lock because it's a small pocket. I'm just going to take it apart, put some cotton in there, and make a little pillow. Gives you a little puffy effect. And then I'll staple it closed with my tiny attacher. We'll get the staple right in the middle. You can always cut if you have any fuzzes left over from the cotton ball. You can always trim it. You know, the, um, the raveling of the canvas actually gives it a great grunge look if, if, you, you know, if you, that's what we're going for. And there's our little embellishment. Very simple. Using some staples, some canvas. I mean, you can do this with fabric. You know, you can do it with anything. So if you're not a sewer like I am, it's a perfect way to uh, create a fun little embellishment with your stamps. So let me show you. I um, completed a tag, Tim Holtz style. You may have seen just uh, recently he's announced instead of the 12 tags of Christmas, he's going to do a tag a month based on the theme or the holiday if there is a holiday that month. So he did a Valentine's Day theme. So based on his ideas from that, I kind of went with this. And this is what I came up with using our pillow, which is up here. I added some stickles to it to give it a pop of color. I inked it up a little grungier look. And there you have it. A simple, fun way to create quick little poofy embellishments for your scrapbook pages and uh, cards and tags. The sky's the limits. Love to see what you guys come up with, and uh, thanks for stopping by. See you soon. Bye.
damn how it's supposed 